Hello everypony, so today I will be showing how to put a head and body together for your silly little end stars avatar. So first, we're gonna go and put the body. This is the body that we have. Um, you see this? It's the thing that says transform. Click one here. One. And one. Set the skill to 1 to all of them to put it as big as this because it comes really tiny. Um, oh yeah, I forgot to mention you also need to download the Cats plugin for Blender. There are several tutorials for that out there. Um, you can find that. And then what we'll have to do is turn off the mesh and the armature. Select all of this. And then click delete. Put the mesh and armature back, and you'll see your outfit over here. Next, we're going to import the head. I have my files organized here. Go to our head here and put our read to head, which is right here. It should look like this. Um, and then we'll check if it's like, yeah, look at that. There's like a slight gap in between that. We'll have to fix that by clicking this thing over here that says move. I'm going to move that slightly like that. Oh shit, wait. Like, just a little bit to put it in there. Wait, that looks a little bit too much. Just adjust it until it seems right. Until it's like fully aligned into what you want. Um, this thing over here, the hand is to drag around. This over here is to turn it around to see if it's good. Sometimes you can't get it perfectly fine. That's okay. Um, it should be fine now. So what we're gonna do is get these two together. Left click and you'll see this thing that says join. Click join for them together so that the body and the head will be connected to one another. And then after that, Click the entire thing, and click this over here, it says Fix Model. It's gonna take a while for it to load. Then, it's gonna appear weird looking like this, but don't worry about it. You click this little white circle over here, that says Viewport Shading, and it'll look better like that. Some textures might be missing, but we can always fix that in Unity. And then... After that, we go here to Visims. We click A and then E and then O. Then we click Create Visims. Then it should appear here saying Created Mount Visims. That is what's going to make our lip sync. Most of these you can just ignore. They're pretty much fine. Go to edit mode. Go to spine. Chest. Neck. Head. So what we're gonna do is press E. And then press C. And then don't move your mouse because it's gonna go all over the place. Just click it. Then it should make a copy of the head. And then we press control, then collect all of the hair. And then what we're gonna do is click parent, click make, keep offset. That is what's gonna make, oh wait, hold on. If it goes to the wrong bone, just redo it again. Control, 
all of this. It should all directly go to the head. All the lines that you see here, it goes to the head so that all the hair follows around along the head. And then after that, we go to export. Click FBX, or save it to whatever you need to put it to. You can just name this the file. And then, boom, we're done. 